Hi, it's Paul from Hobby Link International. Uh, don't forget the subscribe button is down there along with the bell to be notified of future videos from myself and Kenny. Uh, today we're going to have a quick look through some of the pages in U Boat in Focus issue 20. Okay, let's have a look through U-Boat in Focus, edition number 20. Uh, the picture on the front is a clue about what I'd say one of the one of the bigger articles in this issue. So start off, usual things, uh, the contents. And then going through the readers forums, people um, send in personal photographs about uh, articles in, in earlier issues and also corrections or more information about articles in uh, previous issues. Um, it starts off with um, it's got a long article about on this picture there's a couple of versions of this photograph as well um, and also the ones that have been censored as well. Basically it's about a, a doctor on a new 592 um, there's a whole story about how he came to be there, how doctors ended up on U-boats. Admittedly, the U-tankers had doctors, but um, not all the other U-boats had tank had uh, U-boats had doctors. And so it's the story of how this particular doctor came to be there, this particular mission, what happened, and so on and so forth. And then uh, the biggest article in here is about cooks on U-boats. And you can see here this is um, them undergoing training. Uh, they weren't necessarily chefs when they signed up for this. And they had, I think, basically just two, uh, two burners to, obviously electric, not gas, to uh, supply, was it three meals a day plus coffees and snacks um, for, what, 40 people-ish? So there's a whole story about all that stuff, how it all works, the training, what the what the place is, what the kitchens actually look like, what the life is like, how they do that with zero space. Sometimes it goes wrong. Um, there's loads and loads of that. And there's a chef, and there's a chef's hat. Um, and then at the end, towards the end, technical equipment talking about the rotating loop antenna um, radio direction finding system. This one's on the outside of the conning tower. Often they were later boats that were sort of built into the conning tower itself. So there's photographs and all sorts of uh, information about those and how those all worked. Um, first U boat flotilla dining hall. And then um, a couple of bits about a U-tanker. There's some more pictures on the back here about U-tankers to go with the book, the ex well, excellent book that they produced. His final review of that book on our channel as well. It's probably about the definitive book on U-boat tankers. Um, there's a few more bits of information. So there you go. A quick look through edition number 20. Best place to buy this is direct from the publishers. I'll put a link underneath the video. Um, let me know what you think. Thanks.